Okay, another thing that costs money. See, I, mean, I don't care what it is. Whether you just want to be artist and paint like fine art, get in a, in a, in a magazine, make animation, a writer. It doesn't matter. They're all uh, not easy to get into. That's why they call us starving artists, you know what I mean? So, you know, I'm a customer service. That's my job. And I just do this because I enjoy it, you know? It takes forever to get into it and get in there. Um, like I said, people who've already published something, they have first priority. Even people who haven't, who have published something, like um, I'm in a lot of writers, writers groups. I'm in one called um, SCBWI, stands for the Society of Children, Books, Illustrators, and Writers. Um, and you have to pay for membership. It's like $99 a year. Uh, it's supposed to help you be pu published, but it doesn't. Because otherwise I'd be pu published right now. They do have, um, like, a, I do go to a critique group. And you sit around. You talk about people's books. And you say what you, what you liked about it. What you thought they could um, improve on future uh, so it's really helpful I've been with them for years I'm also um, not with the Florida's Writers Association so do you should have a writers group critique groups um, and other writers groups or even artist groups there's even free stuff you can do at Facebook or online you just talk about stuff you give each, each other tips um, on how to get out there. Um, oh, you know what? I'm also going to do inside of this ears paint, too. What do you think? So that's how you learn and grow is from uh, doing all that. Practice, practice, practice. Get into groups that um, like the same thing as you do, the same thing as you. And you can treat each other's work. Ah, poop. I accidentally got yellow. I didn't need to get yellow. I get some more pink. Now, every time you paint, leave the color out. Because you might need it. And then you're like, I've made my mistake. What color do I need again for his ears or whatever? But, uh, my, uh, Go back to school. Um, I've got an A degree. It was in art, um, and I uh, and they had their own they had their own art gallery, and I've won honorable mention twice. Yeah, I need more pink. That's why I said never put it away. I've done it before. Put it away, and then I had to dig through. Like, oh gosh, what color did I use? And then it looks terrible. I forgot what's painting. Sometimes, um, as it dries, you might see that you gotta go over it again. Like, I can see a little bit of uh, that uh, flesh needs to be redone here. Sometimes just going over it with white. Oh crap, see? Got some pink in there. Sometimes you gotta take a, just a regular paper towel. So I keep a whole bunch of paper towels over here, little napkins. I'm gonna do it again. Oh, and if you make a mistake, it's okay. It's easy to fix. You just take this same napkin and you dab at it. And it, it soaks it right up. 
And that's another reason why I start with light. Because you can always cover it up with the dark. Oh, I meant to do that. I meant to put that there. Yeah, again, it, it, um, the dark ones will help cover your mistakes. How you make them. I'm gonna go over it with like a plain white, uh, with nothing on it. This helps make it smooth. So we just have water and we're just going over it, making it smooth. You don't want it bumpy. Now some people use different things. I use paint and um, paper. But I know a great artist on TikTok. Oh my gosh, she is so good. She uh, uses her um, computer, her, lap, her tablet, and she uses uh, so she, in other words, she uses like kind of like computer animation or those um, apps. They have all kinds of apps for drawing. But they do have Adobe Photoshop. No, they're they, they are huge. So, um, it will take up a lot of space, but that's all she uses her tablet for, is to, to art. Alright, so, with paper, especially when you're doing this, gotta get the ones that's called mixed media, or watercolor pa uh, paper. Paper specifically for watercolors, but I like this mixed media. Let's see it's thicker. And if you don't, then um, it will break and uh, the paper will literally break because uh, like the sketching ones, they are not meant for this. I've tried it, really me, I know. They're not meant for this. What's going on here? Why do I keep doing that? Sorry, it was not. Uh, keep getting holes in there. Why is it doing that? I might have to wait to draw and go back over it. So that's what I'll do. Just wait to draw. This is great. I have this overhead light. Let me show you. See, sorry I blind you, but um, well, that's a good angle. Uh, so I can see better. Also, this is a 100 watt bulb, and I had two 100 watt bulbs in my ceiling. But otherwise, there's so many shadows, it's so easy to overlook something. Alright, so, uh, other thing I want on this Easter egg is purple. So I thought pink and purple would be pretty, right? Cause I want this side to be so fun and um uh, and I'm gonna do something fun in the background too, something light. Uh I have to think about that. But uh right now I'm just gonna do this. Okay, of course it's uh, small. I'm watching my camera to make sure you guys are not blocked. I can't decide which one, which uh, thing I want. All right, after this, I'm gonna go and show you what I did so far. Uh, with the art classes, I know I'm going all over the place, sorry. But uh, with the art classes, when I was in college, um, once I get to drawing two, they actually did have live models. You never seen people do live models and nude models and stuff. So she had talked with us. She said, um, okay, so we're going to be professional. I don't want people to be like, Ooh, look at that. Ooh, and doing all that stuff or tell people that you're like in a, uh, porno or seeing new people. Don't tell people this. It's between us. I mean, of course, I don't go there anymore, so I can say. Um, but anyways, because they could literally stop her from doing that. 
and people taking it the, the wrong way. She, so they literally hired uh, real people to model, both men and women, so it wasn't just women. Um, and they'll come, they're dressed. I wondered how that worked. They literally just come there with normal clothes, regular clothes, and they go in the back room, they get undressed, they come up, they have a robe on, they get on the stage, or wherever there's these stand to draw, and then they disrobe. So, no big deal. I have a couple drawings uh, of them, no nudity and all that. She put paper on the windows so people would be peeking in, trying to get a peep show. This is basically professional, like uh, if you go to a doctor's office, you know, no big deal. Get dressed, and so. That was cool, neat experience. All right, so I got that. Let me show you. Put that in the water. Well, it's 41 minutes so far. All right, there you go. On this side, there's not really much on that side. Okay, um, oh, you know what? I, sh I want to do his, um, let me do his tummy peek too. I really wish that when I went to the art school that I stayed longer than a year, but I honestly thought this wasn't what the direction I needed to go in because I wanted to be a, a cartoonist. I always wanted to know what I wanted to be. I was as an eight member, I said that. So, um, But I wish I stayed because um, they did teach me a lot of stuff. Stuff that you do need. I don't care what kind of artist you're going to be. Unless you want to be a writer. But any kind of artist, any 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 art is going to help you learn. So a lot of stuff I've learned uh, through classes, through books. Uh, just And also by trial and error. That's why you got to practice. This is a lot, a lot of trial and error. What works, what doesn't work. Let's go out there, there. Help it tick. Oh, YouTube doesn't block this one because it's got baby shark sound. It's from their library. So, tick, uh, YouTube. Sorry, I'm on TikTok too. YouTube, please don't block, block this. Now to darken the pink, we're gonna use red. Red's a great, uh, make it look uh, darker. Um, you know what, I think I'm gonna leave him white. What do you think? And then the pink. Oops. Sorry guys. Oh, let me tell you, in that same class school, I took sculpture. I hated that. I thought it would be fun. You could do what, make whatever you want. Wrong. You had to learn measurements and math. I'm like, I didn't sign up for math. I wanted to just make stuff. I mean, there's a reason to it because um, we did make a lot of houses and I never, never, maybe because I was terrible at the math or I didn't care. I look, oh my gosh, the, the teacher probably hated my guts. I was, I used to be kind of a spitfire. <laughs> I'm not lying. I was a spitfire, seriously. And so he would say, what's the measures for that? And I said, I literally put on there, I don't know, you're the teacher, you tell me. I literally did that. I bet you this teacher hated my guts. And I hated... I didn't like him either, to be honest with you. Anyways, my house has never stayed together. And I just hated that class. So this is what's good about this brush, see? Um, I mean, oh, you can't see really. But, um... 
I use it to make this smooth. So this is kind of bumpy. I'm doing the smoothing out because it's very, very not smooth. I want it smooth. Don't get too smooth because it's fur, so that's what's good about this. Don't have to be too smooth. It's fur. There we go. Nice. Out. Now, when you're done, you gotta take really good care of your stuff. So you take it in the sink and you rinse them out real good. All right there we go. That's nice. Um, again, probably later I'll go back over this. Plus, some of it is kind of, for some weird reason, it's gotten messy. I don't know why. All right. Um, and for contrast. I think I'm gonna uh, make his shirt light blue. And that's gonna really good look good with that when he's the evil side of the bunny, I think. And also looks good with the uh, pink side too. Let's see, I'm gonna use like a light blue. Now, let me show you my water. Look at that, see? And let me show you what it does so far too. Looking cute. Looking cute. Oh, sorry. Looking cute. That's a good angle, right? I guess you look better. So this is called cool, cool blue, cool, cool blue. I haven't won any awards, like I said, with my writing, but. Uh, That's okay. All right, so now I'm gonna do a shirt. I do it both sides. Was it good? I think this might be a good brush for that. So I'll make a shirt light blue, and then his pants dark blue, like jeans. Gonna talk about. I have uh, three pets. I have two dogs and a cat. My one cat, I and mean, I mean my one dog. His name is Benji. They're both brothers. Came from the same litter. And uh, I have a black one, and his name is Jasper. And I have a cat, and her name is Shelly. I've always loved dogs. Always, always. I don't know why I've always liked them. I used to beg my mom to get me one. She would not. She said I'll be one taking care of them. And then actually, I ended up being um, the one taking care of every dog we've ever had. And also, my sister stayed with us and she had a dog. When I'm, so I'm now doing his eyes too. Decided to do it blue. There we go. When I'm done, I take, I like to take white out and put dots in his eye. Oh, I mean, I think I got paint on my face. Do I? Nope. Felt like it. Um, I take dark blue and do his eyes. I messed up on his, one of his eyes. But that's okay. I think I can cover it up with my paint, I hope. Anyways. That's, like I said, that's what I like about painting and art is uh, even if you make a mistake, you can always cover it up, which is another reason, the fifth, tenth, or whatever reason I'm on now, to always start with, <laughs> with light colors. I don't know what number I'm on, but I know I keep saying that. 
me give you some other art tips while I'm doing this. Um, so, if you want something to look glittery, they do make glitter paint, so I do have glitter paint. I have clear, I have a spray, glitter spray. Um, it's clear, um, but also salt. Regular salt that you put on your french fries. Can you put on a painting when it's wet like this? When it's wet like this, it'll literally stay on. It's not gonna come off and be making a big old mess in your house, no. This is why you do it when it's wet. Like right now, see if I wanted to put glitter, I would do it now, this would be a good time. When it's wet still. Um, anyways, you just put it on there and it looks shiny like I've done mirrors. Mirrors or mythical creatures like uh, dragons, make their scales look shiny and stuff. And also think of your artwork like onion, you know, you're layering it. So this is layer number one with uh, light colors. You know this, oops, I made a mistake, some of the blue got in this case. All right, that's all you gotta do, take this and you know, I'll try to show you at the same time. I'm working on an hour now, okay. So I'm do my best to show you and do it at the same time. So, see how I accidentally got some blue in this face? Look at that, it's just about all gone. Can't even see it anymore, right? You see a little bit, but um, that's okay. It'll come out when I uh, put the dark colors on. Was it playing that song again? I'm not really paying attention. Sorry, guys, if that's boring or whatever. Blame you, Dan. I like your own music, anyways. Especially when I do Christine, you know. Um, I like to have uh, children's music going. This reminds you of a kid. I think like a kid, you know. Especially we do kid stuff. Kids uh, books. I do want to be traditionally published again. It is just really hard. It's not impossible. It's just hard. But anyways, I know a lady. She's had two books published. And they still gave her a hard time. So, I appreciate when people give me advice. But, it's like, I'm the one who looked into this, people. So... If it was that easy, I would have did it. Other people would do it too. So you can remember, thousands of people were applying for that one spot that was in, um, you know, remember earlier talking about that? Thousands of people were applying for that one spot that's in the magazine. Smoothing it out. Shark. Our YouTube, better not bleep this out because it's got um, this from your library. You told me I didn't use your library, so I hope you don't bleep this out. Because I said that's copyrighted. Not my fault, YouTube. This is on your channel. What? Well, there you go. I got that. Well, it's not the actual original tune, so I guess I'll be okay. All right, let me show what I did so far. I'm almost on an hour on this thing. Ta-da! What do you think so far? Now I'm going to do his pants. Dark blue. And I'm going to leave him on the good side white. Just got to take some black paint and you'll see. All right, so let's see. This is a nice dark blue. This is called Primary Blue. I just go to Walmart and I picked up just about every colors they had. And they range from 50 cents to, I've seen some for close to four bucks. Hello. 
Okay. Another thing I love to do is see, I like I do I love anything artistic. So not only just making books, but um, I love to take pictures. Never do nothing with them. Never sell them. This is for me. I also, because I'm creative, like to make TikToks, and I make do all kind of stuff for TikToks. You can check me out, Sarah Bell Wells. Sarah, S A R A, no H, Bell B E L L, Wells, just like on YouTube. W E L L E S. I have my own website too, and that's H T P. Uh, Sarah Bell Wells. Uh, dot uh, W I X dot, uh, dot com slash Sarah Bell Wells. Now this dark blue, I'm gonna do the opposite. I've just been saying this whole video. I'm gonna I'm gonna do um, hot like um, highlights or whatever uh, with light blue actually, like wrinkles. Oh poop! I dripped. I dripped. I just took my paper towel, soaked it up. Yeah, they do make a gummy a eraser. It's literally called gum, and it does feel like gum, literally. Um, and let me tell you, it just pulls boo boos right off the paper. It's really great. It's not that expensive either. They didn't use that to such a great section of art um, at Walmart, but now they do. In the craft in section where you crochet and stuff. No. Yeah. Hey, what else do you guys want to know about me? So, uh, born in Indianapolis, Indiana, and uh, moved to Florida when I was four. People say they do hear. My northern accent, I do have a very bad habit uh, on the phone. I'm customer service. I do mortgages. Okay. And I also have a very bad habit. And I know I'm not doing that for this video because uh, I'm concentrating on art, so of course I'm not gonna be talking fast on it. <laughs> yeah. I'm just done with this. I'm trying to smooth it out. As you go, smooth, smooth, smooth. I've also drawn with, uh, Pastel colors, chalk. I just, this is just my favorite. All right, there we go. Oh, oops, I got paint on my. If you don't, hands don't start looking like this, you're not having fun, you're not doing it right. <laughs> All right, so there we go. Oh, should I show you? Okay, I'll show you. I was trying to see if it was cool recording. Okay, there we go. The black's gonna be the last. You can highlight it instead of um, Sharpie with the black paint, but sometimes the black paint makes too bold of a uh, line. Whoops. I'm sorry, guys. I didn't realize my paper was blocking uh, that. I might have to move it in a minute because I need, I'm going to need my black and some darker colors, but I'm not.